Hi, so my name is Christopher Campbell, and um, I'm one of the youth leaders in this uh, United Religions Initiative uh, Mayapur Conference. And I live in San Francisco, California, just outside of San Francisco, California, in the, U in the USA. And um, I have a school there called the Awakening Heart School, where I teach Reiki, among other things. And uh, Reiki is a, a Japanese form of healing. It's a very simple practice that involves the laying on of hands on oneself or another person and allowing what they call universal life force energy to flow through us. And when we do that, it causes the body to come into alignment with itself, with its own harmonious nature. So uh, a lot of times after a Reiki treatment, people feel a sense of ease and peace and groundedness in their body and in their mind. So about five years ago, I was in a youth leadership conference in the Bay Area um, through an organization called Child of the 21st Century. And there I met the illustrious Miss Sarah Telcott, who is uh, one of the fellow participants in that group. And we, were, we became good friends during that council, the Youth Leadership Council. And just after that, both of us, our work just kind of really expanded. And I remember saying to myself, my goal in this leadership council is to make Reiki available to a wider audience. And it was really interesting because about three months later, I was standing in front of a group of about 150 young people at the University of California at Berkeley, giving a lecture on Reiki. So, and, and it, it didn't, hadn't occurred to me, I hadn't tried to seek that out, it, it had just been given to me to be in front of this room, and as I was standing there giving the lecture, all of a sudden I thought, wow, here I am, my dream has been fulfilled. And so throughout the years, Sarah and I stayed in touch, she doing her global international youth leadership work and me working with uh, young people and teaching Reiki throughout California and Hawaii and um, the mainland United States. And when I found out about Mayapur, it was a beautiful, amazing opportunity for me because I had been wanting to come to India for so long anyways. So here I am, I get to share my work, which I love, this Reiki work, with young leaders and from all around the world here in this place where I've always wanted to come to, which is a sacred pilgrimage for me. So I just feel incredibly grateful um, to be with all these amazing young leaders from all these different traditions to be learning and to be sharing the gifts that I bring to 